All right, so we're going to be taking a closer look at some new racks we got in from a company called Great Lakes Mortar Racks. All of the racks in this video are from Great Lakes Mortar Racks, and I have linked their website in the description of the video. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these racks. The first one I want to take a look at is this large Roman candle rack. I love seeing different types of racks such as this one. They actually offer several different options. This is the most extreme angle one, which is probably my personal favorite and why we have it. <laughs> so you'll see here it holds five 196 shot Roman candles. In this case, we're using the neon tracers. All we had to do is pop the plastic base off the bottom of the Roman candle there so that way it sits into place. And you'll see there's just predefined angle pieces there so that way you can just drop everything into place. So I definitely see using this throughout shows. I would like to uh, shoot this off for the end of this video and if I don't get to, we'll definitely include this in an upcoming show though. Next up, we're gonna look at the two mortar racks which I have up top here. First off, you'll see that the mortar tubes are blue. That is their signature color. Since they are from Michigan, aka Great Lakes, they've chosen the Great Lake blue color. You can also get mortar tubes individually from the racks, but all the racks, to my knowledge, do come with tubes. The tubes themselves are all DR11 12 inch mortars. They're all plugged. I inspected a bunch of them. They all look really good, really well built. So the racks themselves, we have a 36 shot fan rack and then we have the 24 shot adjustable fan rack. So let's take a look at the 36 first. So we just have three sets of 12. These are the double row configuration. There is single row configurations. Pretty much different options available on the website for whatever kind of meets your needs. Overall, the quality is really solid. You'll see here, there's two by fours on the side, two by sixes here on the side. Looks like one by fours on the, for the rails. Um, everything looks really good. They are definitely rugged racks. I actually might put some handles on there just because It'll be easier for me to transport, but they're definitely well built. Next one over here is an adjustable 24. Again, the double row action, six on each row and then 12 in each bank. And you'll see there's different holes here, three different slots. And this is kind of one of the cool things about these racks. You don't see a lot of adjustable ones out there. So when they came shipped to me, they were in the straight up configuration. I just moved it over to the angle. If you want a slightly different angle, or I'm sure even if you want to make your own custom angle, you could absolutely drill another hole and make that happen. To adjust the racks, you just remove this wing nut here, pull the bolt out, move the rack up, put the bolt back in, and tighten the nut down. These aren't going to be going anywhere once this is tightened. It's not like that's going to come loose or anything while it's firing. So anyway, both of these racks being the uh, angled racks, the reason why I like these personally is it just gives a little more spread in the sky, you know, for your show. If all of these, for example, 36 shots were straight up, they're definitely going to overlap. Now, obviously with canisters, you're going to see a lot of overlap anyway, but just to be able to get a little bit different you know, angle. You would be surprised what five degrees on an angle shot down here will look like once it breaks in the sky. Anyway, so these are the new racks I got going on. Hope you guys like them. Hopefully we'll get some footage here of them firing in shows in the near future. If you want to check out these racks for yourselves, you can go to GreatLakesMortarRacks.us. Again, the website is linked in the description of the video. One last thing I'm going to mention. These racks are actually carried at some retail locations, so make sure to keep an eye out next time you're shopping your local retail store. I do not know all the locations off the top of my head, so you will have to refer to Great Lakes Mortar Racks in order to figure out if there's any locations near you that sell these. Thanks again, and I'll see you guys in the next one.